it's Tuesday and guess who just got back home from work? interesting day. Uh, today was the first day of, well, not really of classes, but kind of the first day of school. It was really crowded down at the U of T bookstore, and it was busy. It was really busy, and tonight we're having Midnight Madness. Thank God I didn't have to work until midnight tonight. I would have cried like a little baby. So after work, I went to my friend's house, Benita and Zakia. You guys haven't seen them yet. I will try to capture them on video one day. I know Vanita doesn't want to be on camera, but Zakia doesn't mind that much. <laughs> yeah, we just had a bit of a chat, you know, they're starting classes tomorrow. They're living in an apartment downtown, like right in the center of the U of T campus. So they're really like happy and excited and I'm so happy for them and I get to visit them whenever I want. So yay! Jessica, you asked us what classes we'll be taking this year and this is actually a very easy answer for me. I am taking a year off. I forgot to mention that when I saw you. I'm actually not going to be back at U of T. Uh, although it is kind of weird that I work at U of T, but I'm not going to any classes. It's kind of a weird relationship. Uh, or It's weird because I, I go down there, but I'm not actually doing any classes. So I'm taking the year off just to work, to write, and to basically just figure out exactly what I want. Like I'm almost certain that I want to be a writer, but I'm just wondering if U of T is the right program for me. So I'm just trying to sort things out. Oh, Cynthia, sweetie, I have no idea why they do not sell tricks in Canada anymore. Because I actually noticed that too. And Apple Jacks. They stopped selling Apple Jacks here, and that was like my favorite cereal in the world. I don't understand. We shall investigate. France, how are things? Uh, keep us updated. You know, um, yes, I will post your video tomorrow if you send it to me. Uh, mind you, I work 11 to 7 tomorrow, which means I won't be home until 8.30. And I, uh, the video might be on late. Katie, weirdly enough, I don't have much to say to you other than I, I heart and I really wish that you could come to Toronto soon so we could chill and go shopping. In a way, it feels really weird. Like, I, every year, you go back to school and you get those butterflies in your stomach and it feels really weird not to be going back. I mean, for the longest time, I feel that school kind of defines you, especially because you're there most of your life. I mean, kindergarten, well, daycare, kindergarten, one, grade one, grade two, etc., grade 12, university, graduate school, you never stop learning. So when a break like this comes along, it feels weird. Like, I don't have a definition for myself. School, for the longest time, is what defines me, and now it's just kind of not there. Do you guys understand what I'm saying? It's it's a very weird feeling. Song of the Week is in the sidebar. It is Twist and Shout by the Beatles. I love them. I just watched Ferris Bueller's Day Off two years ago, and I love that scene in the parade where he's lip syncing to it. It is amazing. Matthew Broderick rocks. Friends, my darling, I will see you tomorrow.